the 4pm duo T.O.P. expressions. So let's find out what suitable and useful expressions we can use in various situations. All right, let's do it. This is the first expression. 첫 번째 표현입니다. 여기서 버스로 두 정거장만 더 가면 돼. Mm, okay, this is, sounds like a short stop. Yeah. You'll get to your destination in no time. Not too bad. So, of course, here, 정거장. 정거장. How would we say that in English? Uh, bus stops. Yeah, a bus stop or a stop. Mm. Right, so in total, you can say, it's just two more bus stops from here. It's just two more bus stops from here. All right, let's move on to our second expression. 두 번째 표현입니다. 내릴 때는 미리 하차 배를 눌려야지. Okay, so this is a really good system that we have in Korea. 한국에서 이 배일 시스템이 있는 게 되게 어, 좋죠. Oh, I thought it was international. Really? Do you not have it in Canada? In Canada, we have this string... That oh, you, you have, pull. Wow, you have a string. Yeah, you have a that's, string. That's old school. On the side of the bus wow. that you pull, and uh, and that's that's basically the bell. Oh, 영국에서는 배를 눌려야 해요, 한국처럼. Ah, interesting. Okay. You press the stop button, and then it n- lets the bus driver know that you want to get off. Right. So, of course, uh, that is the bell mm-hmm. that you're going to ring. Uh, now, in total, you could say, before getting off, 내리기 전에, ring the bell in advance before getting off ring the bell in advance so you can just say bell in korean you say hata bell which is the bell to get off mm-hmm. but people will know what you're saying if you just say bell so ring the bell if you want to before getting off right so from the context you can decipher and you can discern that the bell means the exit bell mm. 그리고 영국에서는 영국에서는 이 하차라는 단어가 있잖아요 mm-hmm. we have a word that we use for hata it means oh. to alight. Alight? Alight. A L I G H T, I believe. <laughs> I'm not thinking it. That was training for you. Alighten. Mm. So you'll hear it on the buses and the subways. It should say, before alighting, please check you have your phones oh. or something like that. Wow, good tip. Right. So you can say to get off or to alight. Right, to alight. And of course, that mainly applies to the UK because that's a very interesting word, but I've never heard of it. Too being sophisticated used. for Canadians, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there he goes. Burn. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding, of course. Well, on that note, let's move on to expression number three. 세 번째 표현입니다. 모약 자석은 미리 비워놔야 돼. Okay, this is very important, right? Yes, so uh, we have 노약 자석, which is, of course, uh, seats for the handicapped or the weak and infirm. Mm-hmm. And uh, people generally say the handica- handicapped seating area. Right, the handicapped seating area or the handicapped seats. And uh, 미리 비워놔야 해. Okay, 비워놔야 해 mm-hmm. means, of course, to leave vacant. Vacant. V A C. A and T. Vacant is empty. Right, so you should leave it vacant. Right, so in total you can say handicapped seating should be left vacant. Handicapped seating should be left vacant. All right, then let's move on to our fourth expression. The fourth expression is. Ooh, okay, 비싸거든. 비싸거든. <laughs> I'm just letting you know. <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Exactly. Uh, so, do you have 좌석 버스? First of all, what is 좌석 버스? So, 좌석 버스 is, of course, just seat-only buses. Mm-hmm. Seat-only buses. So, buses that only have seats, right? Kind of, kind of like coaches would have yeah. only seats. Right. You know, they're kind of bigger. Uh, if you get the 1001 bus, that usually is only seats. You're not supposed to stand. Mm-hmm. All right, then. So in total, you can say seat-only bus fares are more expensive than regular buses. Seat-only bus fares are more expensive than regular buses. So fares is F-A-R-E-S, uh, which is 요금이란 뜻이죠. So fares, uh, or the cost or the price, you can say fares. Right, exactly, fares. Mm-hmm. All right, then. Let's move on to our last expression. 다섯 번째 표현입니다. 버스 정류소 전광판에서 버스 도착 시간을 알수 있어. Okay, now this is very useful. It's a long sentence. So yeah. if we break it down, 버스 정류소 전광판. Mm. That, of course, is the electronic board at the bus stop. 
Right. So, 전광판 would be the electronic board mm-hmm. uh, where you can see your bus. You know, usually there's a there's a image 그림이 있죠. 버스 그림 뿅뿅뿅 이렇게 가는 이미지가 있죠. Right. So, of course, you can see that on the electronic board at the bus stop. And, of course, bus stop is 버스 정류소. Yes. Uh, so, in total, you can say... You can see the bus arrival times on the bus stop electronic board. You can see the bus arrival times on the bus stop electronic board. Right. So it's a it's not it's a long sentence, but if you know each word, it's very simple. I think. 